Hello and welcome back to Paper Mario The Thousand Year Door. Uh, yesterday I didn't record anything because I was actually pretty busy yesterday. So I didn't want to record anything and then immediately have to leave. So today is going to be picking up right where we left off. And it's just going to have a day break in between. I wasn't expecting to be as busy as I was. But I was busy yesterday so I apologize. But, without further ado, let's get right into this. How do I damage these? I forget. Oh wait, do I need a POW block? Do I have one? I do. Okay. Uh oh. Piranha plants. I didn't think I'd be seeing piranha plants in the game, to be honest. I can barely hear myself talk because of the fact that I have allergies right now and they are clogging my ears and it's really annoying. So I hope this changes soon. kidding me Oh, I'm gonna level up here, so that's pretty good. Yep. I'll level up here, which means I'm gonna be level six, which means I'm gonna grab more health. Yeah, I'm gonna get more health. Cool. Alrighty. I think I see an in card over there. There, you can see it, that big tree. That's what I was telling you about. That's where beef punies live. That's home. Uh, of course, it's not just us in the tree. Lots of jabbies and piters, too. Well, anyway, Mario, follow me. I will follow you in just a sec. What the hell? Who are you, buddy? Hey, 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 ho. I've got all the hottest new products right here. Look no further. Okay. Miss Mini, Mr. Mini. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna buy some mushrooms. Yeah. 
Yeah. Okay. Now, instead of going directly to the... Instead of going directly over there, I want to see what's over here. Oh, yeah, okay. I can't do that just yet. Maybe I can. I don't know. I think my next level up will be more flower points. Oh, this is gonna hurt me, I already know that. No, it didn't. Okay. Well, okay then. I thought that was gonna hurt me for sure. That's done now. Alright, let's go actually do what we're supposed to. Take a look. This door wasn't here before. Someone just installed it. And I can't open it. I thought I could finally save everyone. I'm a fool. Hey, don't take it so hard. It doesn't look sturdy. It does look sturdy, though. What do we do now? Uh, uh, mm, 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 mm. Got it. Mario, come here. Long ago, the puny elder told me about a secret entrance somewhere around here. We'll get that way. We'll get in that way. Uh, problem is, I doubt finding it is going to be easy. I mean, it won't be labeled secret entrance. Not to be a worry, Willard, but how in the heck can we find a secret entrance? Well, it's hidden by this invisible thingy. We need to find and remove the, the thingy. Boy, but removing a normal thingy sounds tough enough, let alone an invisible one. Uh... Oh, got it. Flurry. Surely, Madame Flurry's power can help us. Flurry is a refined and dignified lady who lives in these woods. The Elder, say she, uh, the elder says she's a wind spirit who can uh, wield the power of the air with ease. You see where I'm going with this? She can use wind power to blow the thingy away. Well, it won't hurt to try. Flurry lives in the deepest corner of the woods. So, let's head back in the direction we came from. Okay. Ah, uh, these woods are the most wonderful in all the world. Yes, indeed. Building a house here was just the finest idea I ever did have. Oh my, yes. This place is so different from the uh, bright flash bulbs of the world I'm used to. 
Fetch peace. This negative image of the real world soothes my body and soul. But what's even better is that I, Madame Fleury, grow even more lovely here. Plus those uh, squishies, adorable little peonies that live in the tr in that tree are so nice to me. But I suppose if I stay here too long, I'll begin to crave hustle and bustle before long. Oh, oh my, it's happening even as I speak. Already I feel the need for drama. That moment of uh, exhilaration when the spot spotlight shines down on the stage on me. Surely I was born to be an actress for the ages. It's settled then. I shall rise again, but before I make my stage come back, I simply must whip my body and mind into shape. I'll just have to put some makeup and uh, put on some makeup and make my beauty even more beautiful. Wait a moment. No, it's gone, gone! I tell you, my my. Well, I don't know it's gone, but. If we head east from here, we'll see Fleury's place in no time. So I was supposed to go east. Okay. Um... Okay, so I'm bad at that. Oh, I didn't see that. God damn it. Ooh, there's a shine spray. And a star piece that I just missed. Shit. <laughs> There's no reason for that cussing. I don't know why I always do that. First of all, I want the shine sprite though. Okay, well. Oh, I know how I get that shine sprite. I'm dumb. Let me go ahead and grab this star piece. Shine Sprite. There we go. Wake Hammer Badge. Uh, yeah, I will take that. I don't really use that. I'm gonna need more badge points. Oh, right. Okay. Volt mushroom.
All right, we're gonna go meet Madame Fleury. Uh, excuse me. Um, maybe she isn't here. I wonder if she went for a walk in the woods. Let's find out. Madam Flurry, hello. If you're here, say something. She's dead. Someone killed her. Eek. No, out of the question. You mustn't come in here. Uh, Madam Flurry, are you there? Is that you? What are you doing? Oh, wait a minute. Those darling squishy, uh, squishy little footsteps. Is that you, Puno? Punio? Oh, it's been an age since I saw you last. You poor dear. Is there something you need? Well, uh, well, the thing is, we have a problem. The great tree's entry hole is blocked. My puny friends are trapped inside, so they're in a pickle. And Mario needs those these crystal stars. It's a train wreck, really. That's why we, uh, we need you to come with us and find the secret entrance, Madame Fleury. Oh, is that all, dearie? You came here. You came all. Uh, you came all the way here for just for that, my adorable little punio. You know I would. I would do anything in my power to help you. However, lament, lamentably, I'm in a bit of a bind myself. I just cannot come out. Gee, is something wrong? It's somewhat embarrassing, but I never. Oh. It's somewhat embarrassing, but I never go out without my favorite necklace. I just can't find the blessed thing. I suspect I dropped it on my daily constitutional. I'd be simply scandalized if anyone saw me without it, so I shan't be going out. I absolutely must have that necklace to highlight my beauty. To highlight my beauty, and that's that. Gee whiz, that must be some nice necklace, huh? Hang on. You know what? It's weird. I'm sure I heard, just heard someone talking about a necklace. What's that? Do speak up. You, whoever just spoke, do you have some clue as to where my, uh, as to my necklace's whereabouts? If you do, you must help me. Please, be a dear, find it, and bring it back to me. After that, I will most certainly join you and help my squishy little friend, Punio. Don't worry, Madam Flurry. I'm sure Mario can find your necklace. Where it is, he's super. You can do it, right, Mario? Sure. I think I need to turn my game volume up. I need to watch this recording back. Great. It's decided. Then let's go and find it. I'm sorry to trouble you, Cell. Uh. I wonder what would have happened if I had came here before that. Beldum, I told you. You blamed me for losing the sketch, but you had it. Silence, you twit. Now's not the time. Just get hung... To, ju to get hung up on stupid details. We must study this sketch. Wow, this Mario guy looks so manly. Check out that bushy mustache. How handsome. You know something, though, lo my lovelies? I swear I've seen this gentleman before. Ack, he's Mr. Mustache. Ack, I don't believe this. Vivian, this is, without a doubt, all your fault. I'll be dealing out some strict punishment later, my dearie. Oh yes, I promise you that. What? That's not fair. You're the one who had the... Silence, you squirrel brain. Don't you cop that... Uh, insolent attitude with me. This is not fair. And about that necklace, I was thinking of returning it to you, but no more. Aww. And since you caused this problem, you have to figure out how to find this Mario chump. Well, we're coming right to you, so... I'm gonna hit you in the back of the head with my hammer if I can. That'd be pretty funny. Alright, now I'm gonna replenish my hearts, though, if I got a battle coming up.
See, normally I would want those battles, but I just, I don't. Although, I guess I should, huh? Damn it. I meant to hit that damn thing. Whatever. Yeah, no. I'll take the 12 star points though, always. Let's go, finally. Easy enough. Damn. Well, if it isn't Mario. Shining mustache or no, you can't be too bright if you came here looking for us. <laughs> and you know why? Because you, because we were wa uh, waiting for you. Were you? Uh-huh, uh-huh. I remember. They're the ones that with... Hey, wait a second. What do you mean you've been waiting for Mario? That sounds suspicious. I have no quarrel with you, but I simply can't allow you to hunt for those for the crystal stars. And so I'll be taking that little map of yours just as soon as I deal with you. No, you won't. Whoa, whoa, scary lady. How do you know about the map and, those, and the crystal stars? Have you talked to Princess Peach or something? Hey, now that I think about it, who are you anyway? Those who seek names are often disappointed, but if you insist, we'll tell you. We are the three Shadow Sisters. The three Shadow Sisters? Sounds dumb. Vivian, you nimcompoop. What are you babbling about? It's just shadows. The three shadows. Sisters make us sound less mysterious and less scary. How many times must I remind you? Oh, right, sis. I'm sorry. It's just it makes me really happy when you call me your sister, so... How insufferably sappy. Oh, you've got, uh, oh, you've got some fierce punishment coming your way. Aw, oh, gee whiz. I hate being punished. That's for later, though. First, we have to deal with this Mario and his friends. Let's do it, my lovelies. Marilyn, Vivian, the might of the three shadows, relation fill withheld. <laughs> Will be more than enough to win the day. That's funny. Alright. It's most unlucky that our sights are set on you. Well, unlucky for you, of course. Marilyn, Vivian, let's show precisely what we can do. Yes, sis. Wouldn't have wanted to if I tried, game. What, are the, what the hell does that mean? I don't... I don't even know. I just get boxed? Okay. Did zero damage. Cool. Alright, I'm gonna go ahead and use the normal hammer real quick. Just smash this person's face. And... We'll use that. What are you doing, Vivian, you twit? I'll never forgive you if you lose. Sorry, sis. Okay. Okay, that's gotta be a plus two attack, yeah. 
Minus two. Tiny attack power has now dropped. Uh oh. Well, that's not fun, but. Did that even do anything? Sorry, sis. Okay. No. What the hell? Yeah, that... That makes sense. How? Okay... You're tougher than I thought, Mr. Mustache. I guess it's time to stop toying with you, hmm? Okay. I don't know if I'll ever get that down. Back. Thirty star points, though. That's always really nice. Maybe we were just a touch overconfident. Marilyn, Vivian, you lumps. We would have won if you two pulled your weight. Both of, uh, this person's a really narcissistic. Oh my god. Both of you prepare for a world-class punishment session when we get home. But the necklace. Leave it. See, I like that one. I like the one that was just like, that was, uh, I think Vivian, I think. That's Fleury's necklace. Yes, let's take it to her. I like Vivian. I do not like the other two. Damn it. Oh, crap. Eh. I thought that was going to do damage. Oh well. I'm a little slow. I'm a little slow. I could have just used... Yeah, I'm a little slow. I could have done that and took no damage, but no, I'm dumb. Damn it. I'm really mad at myself for that. Oh well, it's not a big deal. I right, let's go talk to this guy. I'm gonna buy some fire flowers. And then I'm gonna buy some more honey syrup. That'll bring me down to exactly 300 coins. Cool.
No! Whatever. Fine. No, no, that wouldn't work. Uh, that only did one damage. Damn it. Okay, so you just healed him. Okay. Oh, what? Okay. Uh, that's not good. You're gonna come down? No, you're not. Okay. Oh, I actually did it! Wow, I actually did it. Okay. I don't know how that works, but I'm sure I'll figure it out eventually. I hope I'll figure it out eventually. Probably not, to be honest, but. And I really do not have the health to be messing around, so. No. Okay, cool. And they cost me seven for that, so. see my precious necklace again oh you delightful fellow you found my necklace I'm beside true I'm beside myself truly but you still mustn't see me please leave the necklace by the door and wait a moment yeah. oh splendid splendid my oh so ravishing necklace I'm a wash in joy oh no is that a disco bomb? Oh, I know the title of this episode. Oh, oh my world. Mario, isn't it? Are you my heroic little necklace hunter? Well, my, my, my. Aren't you a fine specimen of a man? Yes, indeed. I simply must thank you for your graciousness. But how to do it? Hmm, perhaps if I grabbed you and gave you a little sugar? <laughs> Here I come, handsome. Time to pick a- time to give a proper thank you. Pucker up. <laughs> oh, this is the funniest part of this game so far. 
Oh, Mario, you are just the cutest little thing I've ever laid eyes on. Can the music stop, please? That'd be nice. Yes, you are. And that, that. So tell me, are you truly looking for the crystal stars? The very same crystal stars spoken of by the lo uh, lowlifes in Rogueport? Hmm, a danger-filled search for beautiful jewels. How absolutely mar uh, marvelous. And here I was, thinking how frightfully bored I was. It's time for a change. Are you joining me? And besides, I do declare that plush mustache of yours has completely swooned me. A man as manly as you must attract all sorts of trouble, and I want to keep you safe. So I dare say, I'll be joining you on this little adventure. I assume that's fine, Mario? I guess. Flurry's ability, a primer. While pressing X, Flurry will exhale strong gusts of wind that you can blow things away. That can blow things away. Hold down X to blow away paper. Ooh. Okay. If she blows in the direction of an enemy, she can make its head spin for a bit. Hold X to make the head. Yeah. Now I can jump on him. Okay. There's a few pieces... There's a few areas that that's going to be useful. She can also squash enemies in battle with a body uh, with a body slam or blow them all with away with gale force. This is wonderful. It's so nice that Flurry likes, likes you, Mario. Really, it's great. And even more importantly, Flurry's chosen to join us. Let's go to the Great Tree. I might need to wait a minute. Uh, but for today's episode, I'm gonna go ahead. My depth perception has really failed me recently. But for today's episode, I'm gonna go ahead and end it off here because there's a few different areas. Well, not because of that. I've been it's because I've been recording for 40 minutes, but. There's a few different areas that I need to go and watch back and look at, like, the paper stuff that I can blow away. And I need to write those down. So, I'm going to do that. And I hope you guys enjoyed today's episode. And I'm sorry that there wasn't an episode yesterday. But, like I said, I was busy. So, but it should be every day from here on out. So, I will see you guys in the next episode. Goodbye.